One of the biggest things at Valentine's Day is obviously price, impulse, something that's quick, easy for you to make in the shop. These small um, little bags are very, very useful because it's one way of creating quite a quick, simple design that you can send out. And they come in all various colours from hot pinks, lime green, so you can use them for any occasion all the way through the year. What I'm going to do here is I've taken the red metallic kiss cellophane on the clear and then I've added a black tint behind so it's really sort of just creating a real nice lushness to the piece. I've taken a piece of floral foam and I have cut the floral foam to the right size so it just sits at the top of the actual bag and I'm going to now take my floral foam and lay it on the table and I want to make sure that I've got a longer area at the back and I'm just going to gently fold either side the cellophane so that I can lift, making sure that I have the front to me and placing in the cellophane straight into the actual carry bag. So this is the front of the design, this is where there's no crease, which is most important. And now I can just gently tease the actual cellophane and just do a little bit of trimming so that what I'm wanting the cellophane to do is to naturally fold up so it's giving me this nice shape here, this like teardrop effect. So once we are have everything in place. This means that this can now be filled up with water because it's waterproof. So it can be stood in the shop ready um, for a customer to pick up. We're first of all going to take some of the black Dracaena leaves and we're going to start off by working into the floral foam. So first of all we're just going to take the leaves quite high on one side. We're going to take a small amount of salal leaves and we're going to just place the salal leaves so it's gently starting to open the cellophane. So just on a slight angle, so this is now opening the cellophane which is going to make it easier. It's going to make it look larger. Now we've just added some salal leaves just to create a little bit of depth to the design. I'm going to take one twig that's just got a little bit of red so we can just stand that quite high. And the reason we're going to use this is so that we can create more interest into the design. I'm going to first of all just roll my aspidistra leaf. And I'm just going to take a wire through the back and cut. So that just holds my leaf in place. And I'm just going to trim away that extra excess leaf there. And what that does for me is it allows me to have a nice cleaner finish just to actually place into the centre of the design. Got three beautiful long stemmed Naomi roses here, and because my stem is going to go in, I'm going to make sure that when I push my stem into the foam, it's going to go right the way down to the bottom of the bag. So the last drop of water is where the rose will actually take it from. So you're not going to have any problems with them drooping, making sure you've cut on a nice sharp slant. So now we can push this rose very very deeply into the actual bag. I'm working on the same process with your other three roses, your other two roses sorry, we can then push again deep into the design, we can
can then add your next rows. Just have a look at that. And I am just taking away anything that is just distracting from the roses so that we can see each flower in its own right. So now we've got just three roses, which is very much symbolic to I love you. And I'm just going to take some steel grass and I'm just going to add the steel grass into one side of the design and I'm going to take one more stem on the opposite side of the design. So these are going to then be gently brought over so it really creates that wonderful movement and space within your piece. I'm going to just take a wire and catch at the top. We're just going to take off all those long pieces just adding a very simple little red heart in there and there you have something that is really quick and easy it looks visually very expensive but it's one way of making very very good profit without actually spending a lot of money on expensive containers just using a very simple bag really makes all the difference